We would like to present our new light box for our PCB productions. Voila! Very nice, very nice. Very nice. Can we can we look inside and see what it is? Of course we can. How much inside? Well, let's let's start from I don't know, either side. Let's see. We have a bunch of LEDs here. 124? 24? I guess. Alright. Right. So um, we have a savage touchpad yep. from a laptop. And we have a two by sixteen characters L C D display. Yep. We can take a look inside. Oh, of course, uh, you had to mention that we're, we're still missing the, the, the glass plate. True, yeah. and there's still many things we're missing, but yeah. we have this. Maybe you will tell about it. Yeah, we have a basic uh, on off switch, so when you, if you open the, the lid in the process, um, it will stop the process, uh, pause, pause the process, and then it, it will begin again when you close the lid. So you don't get so. ultraviolet radiation in your eyes. <laughs> yep. That wouldn't be fun. Yep, yep. So right. we can start with the first layer, to see behind the, our display and so on. This is basically how, basically how it looks. We have our the, the LCD display, we have our touchpad, and then the, the buffer to make a warning sound when it's done. Or oh. warning sound. Yeah. Test sound. And, and you won't be able to not notice it. Nope. You will figure that out later. Beautiful, yep. beautiful. And uh, let's take a look beneath the big engine. I guess we can do here. But it's still an early prototype. We are 80% done, I guess. Yeah, something like we need to make uh, some bottom plates and then some look. The idea is in here there will be a acid tray. Yes. Which we have. Yeah. I can just hold this. Which we have there. Right here. Made by stainless steel, I guess. Yep. All right. So that that should be able to support it. Um, the idea is that the tray will slide in and out from this. From the side. Yes. Um, yeah. Here we can actually see the LEDs, all the wiring, and here we got the control electronics. We are having a small CNC here, run by Arduino. Um, it is actually able to control the whole thing. Um, everything is routed through a MOSFET, which the Arduino controls. Hiding somewhere in there. Yeah, it's right there. Exactly. Um, and that's basically it. It's actually a quite simple setup, simply because of the the brute power power of the Arduino. Yep. So we could basically avoid to make a bunch of circuits just programming through it. Well, what about we make a small demonstration? Yes, of course. All right. Turn it on. Yeah. Go for it. On the screen it says, "Welcome." Select mode. So in order to select anything, you, you are you need to operate this touchpad. And it works simply by any other touchpad system you know. By swiping, select which side you want to use. Currently only have one side, but we're planning to use two sides with LEDs. So we're gonna take a bottom side and tap it. And now we have to choose a time. And we don't really know how much, so by doing a circular motion on the touchpad you're able to control how much time we should have. So let's say we want to like 20 seconds, just for the demonstration purpose. We tap it, and it says close the lid. And by doing that, now the light is activated. And you can actually see, yeah. Of course we're missing the, the side plate. Yeah, there's still stuff missing, but that's the whole point. And during this action, the timer will count. And if you end up closing by opening the lid, it will turn off by itself, and the timer will be preserved. So, by closing it again, it will continue from the same point where it started, where you left it. When it's done, you're gonna hear the buzzer, <laughs> which you can't avoid to hear. And it's actually that simple. When it has buzzed five times, it will return to the normal state, and you can you're able to start over. And it has saved the time variable, so if you are interested in using the same time variable, it is going to be the same as you preset it before. Yep. Beautiful. My name is Nikolai Kandelson and this is... Cosmos Cock! <laughs> beautiful. And we made this.